Welcome everyone to the grounding mini practice. And today in this practice, we're going to dance to ground. You're going to ask your body, listen to your body, what movements want to come so that you can ground. And what do I mean by grounding? Grounding is when we are grounded into the earth, connected into the earth, connected into our bodies and present in the present moment. We feel clear and focused and rooted and calm. So that's what it means to be grounded. And I am going to suggest some ways to move in this practice, but I highly recommend that you try them on, but then also listen to the movements that naturally want to come from your own body. We'll be dancing with the glutes, the legs, the ankles, and the feet, primarily these parts of the body, because those are the ones that are connected into the root energetic center the center in your body, the energetic center in your body that is connected to keeping us grounded and rooted. You'll be dancing to energize, to clear, and to balance this energetic center. And this is a practice, so I recommend coming back to this practice over and over again. See how your practice changes. How does, your, how does it feel every time that you do it? Do you feel different? And after the practice, please let it know, us know how it was for you in our private online community. I love to hear from you. So let's start. So finding a spot, finding a spot in the room that feels right for you to start. And you're just gonna start by walking around your space. Just walking. Really pay attention to the sensation of your feet touching the ground, touching the earth, touching the floor beneath you. And when you feel it feels right in the music, you might start to add a little bounce with your walk. Okay, start to let that bounce turn into a little bit of a gentle stomp. Gentle stomp on the ground. other movement that I feel comes to me is heel drops. So you're lifting your heels up and drop, drop, drop. So you got stomping on the earth and dropping your heels down. Ah, take some nice deep breaths into your nose, out through your mouth, breathing into your perineum your glutes, your legs, your knees, your feet. <sighs> and it sometimes helps to find some low sounds to help you ground. <sighs> okay, another move you can try is imagining you have like a really big monkey's tail at the base of your spine. How would you dance with that monkey's tail? It's really heavy, it's rooting you down. You might feel this in the, your legs, but that's good, that's energizing them. Ah. Okay, just give some space to your body. Again, with your attention on your perineum or the base of your spine. Your glutes, your legs, your feet. What movements want to come? Trust your body. What do you need to do to ground? Ask your body. Yeah, and those low sounds can really help. Sometimes it can feel good to just also give your legs, your feet a little shake out, like a little shaking out. And your glutes too.
Again, just trusting the movements that also want to come. Your intention is to ground. Shake it out. Good job. Good job. Shake it out a little bit. You might take a little moment of stillness just to notice how are you feeling? <sighs> how are you feeling right now? I'm feeling more energized, awake, present. <sighs> yeah. Take note of how you feel. Thank you. So again, like I said, this is a practice. Do you recommend coming back to it a few times? It's a great little short little practice. If you're feeling unfocused, scattered all over the place, maybe up in daydreams, up in the clouds, come and try this practice on. See how you feel after. If you're feeling scared or weak or lethargic, also a good time to do this practice. And please let it know, us know how it goes for you in our private online community. I look forward to hearing from you.